welcome to the cloud network today i am going to show you how to install centos on your virtual box so to install centos uh, let me show you the link where you can download the centos so open this first virtual box i will show you about this one it's a virtual box website uh, for latest version this is a 4.13 and here is for windows supported linux solaris and this is a centos open this google and type centos this is the download like page is showing this is the centos there are two things whether you can download from dvd as well or everything as well which on uh, this one is a torrent from you can download one click i will show you a dvd as well which when you click on this one this is the alternate uh, links is showing to download this one uh, you can download from uh, actually links country or nearby country first click on this one the link first uh, this the size is 3.9 gb showing uh, to install the uh, in your uh, virtual box which i have already downloaded uh, let me show you about this one this one is which i have already downloaded let me show you in virtual box how to install click on it create a uh, type send uh, os about selecting the send os uh, just scroll down select other linux 32 bit 64 bit and this ram assign the ram and click on next click on create click on next next uh, this one is your location where you are going to store your centos so i am assigning the hard disk for centos given 35 gb go to settings change uncheck flop is scroll down and then go to this location where your center is, is there upon selecting this one dvd double click on this one go to network assign bridge adapter ok go to start so here is a uh, Installation about uh, direct you can install or else test this media and install the old OS Android. I am going to direct install my uh, CentOS. Click press enter. So select your uh, welcome to the screen is coming you need to select your language by default select english and just uh, scroll down click on continue according to your which country you belong to you need to select whether you belong to chinese then you can select for chinese for russian you can select for russian so this is the installation uh, time showing its New York time zone. If you want, if you want to change me, like click on this one, select India, and here is scroll down and select India. So from this one, you can select where is India. Upon scroll down, scroll down, Kolkata is showing. Right, select the Kolkata, and after selecting that. But uh, you can check your time is time network time is there automatically it will detect. So if you access the time, here's the date it's showing, and here's the time 24 hours a.m. p.m. You can select a.m. p.m. or else 24 hours, and then done it. Here I have selected time keyboard and language support is supported. Here is software is there. Installation so is selected, manually selected. This one network is can not connected. Showing will connect after the installation. I'll show you installation destinations uh, automatic partitions was selected. Okay, uh, just scroll down it and here yes, select this one which one you want to assign. Whether you want to install automatic, see automatic configuration. I will configure means you know to select manually you want to give your partition. 
or I would like to make an additional space means you can select this one so just click on this one if you want to add any hard disk means hard disk means you can add it click on done no disk was selected double click done this we are going to select this uh, device where you can so that we can ensure this address just uh, click on this one so this as you can see on screen this is the right mark it showing as uh, indicate that it has been selected the device and done after done showing the see automatic selected the partition showing click on began installation so here is need to set uh, root password just click on scroll up assign the root password please remember the password this which you are going to assign if you forward means we can reset this root password which i have made a, a video on how to reset the password this password i have done and click on done user we need to select a user to login the full name i am giving a cloud network and here is a username that i am going to select that that is i am going to write cloud only and make this my admin setup required a password to use this account yes we have set the root password before that one now we are setting the password of just now user new created so just click on done so this one is the root password we have set and this one user administrator administrator we have set and we have given full permission till this installation is coming showing this 295 files will be installed come it will install so it will take some time before that you can have a coffee or tea This one is installing kernel. Now installation has been completed. As you can see on screen, CentOS is not su successfully installed on, on your system, ready to use. Go ahead and reboot. Now I am going to reboot it now. Now it's and to need to press and enter. Just press enter. It's booting. Now login page scan. We need to login and tapping a root with the root and I'm assigning the password which I have login do given during the past installation. So this has been login. You can check. This is a kernel showing about this one. And slash give a home slash and this one is a, right. So this one is your installation about this. A file and a user you can log in with the user which I have created with cloud so has been logging so this is the uh, installation of my uh, CentOS Linux 7 with the version of 7 so you can reset the password if you forget means uh, just restart this one and select the options to resume that there and you, there you can reset the password so thank you for watching my video id cloud net please subscribe to my uh, videos and have a nice day thank you